Was there anyone that was supposed mm-hmm. to be on Girl that never got on? Henry. In the beginning, Henry, Henry Sanchez. Yeah. Oh, Henry was. Mm-hmm. What happened with that? Uh, he didn't. I, I truly, I don't. I, he was getting paid a good amount of money at that time, and I don't think he was ready to mm. sacrifice I think, if, if uh, everything was going to work out or not. Uh, what, day one, too, right? No? Mm, or he had a pretty solid deal over I'm there. Not sure. I, I, I'm not sure if day one was in the in the loop. I'm not sure, because I was on the outside. Right, theory, right, so. right. Yeah, that would be a Gav question. I think Henry had a falling out on tour, on a blind tour with somebody. It was like a blind plan B something tour combined. Mm. And like I think there's some something might have a falling out of some situation, but and then day one, I don't think day one would ever have left Rodney to be honest. Yeah. I don't know. Not at that time, yeah. What about chocolate? Anyone that was supposed to be on chocolate that never? Yeah, there's a yeah there was. A I feel like there's more dudes that got left out of chocolate than girl, right? Hmm. I, mean, I mean, I thought Kareem. I thought there was a few other people. Yeah, um, Shiloh possibly. Mm. Yeah. I don't know. There was a lot of dudes that definitely. Yeah, it's so interesting, like the inner workings of it, because like if you're like Rick and Mike and Spike and who you know, like trying to all your friends and all these great skaters, like how like getting girls started and then chalk, like how do you. There's so many egos you're dealing with too at that time. Like these, a lot of these guys were like fucking yeah. at the top of their game. So, you know, did you that gotta, create any like sort of not animosity but like uh, competitiveness really with those guys like Daywan or or Kareem I or think, something like that? I, I think I I think so. Honestly, I think naturally, how could it not? You know what I mean? Right, yeah, right, right, right. Because right. Right. now you got two heavy hitting teams, a new team. And obviously Rocco was like trying to stab at you guys doing, what do you call it? Like bitch, bitch skateboard. skateboards. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. Gavin had a pro model. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> what? Describe the graphics. What were the graphics? Chris? <laughs> I don't know. I don't remember. Do you know that dude, Sal Rocco, who sold that company, bitch, sold it to some Japanese company for like $5 million or something crazy? No really? way. Unbelievable. Yes, dude. What? Yeah. So that company yeah. still exists. I'm sure it is. I'm sure in I mean, Japan it is. I mean, Fine. it could. You better yeah. get some royalties, Gav. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, wait how how long was it even around? Not even that long. Not that long, but he, he definitely tried to so? hold on. I mean, a year is a long time at that time. That's true. Fuck, it seemed like forever. What did you guys think of that when that happened? He's corny as fuck. Yeah, like <laughs> <laughs> straight up. I mean, that's just as a young kid, I thought that shit was corny as fuck. Right. But like, obviously, it was very like, damn, you guys are really, you're really going at it. But I, I wasn't not surprised because they, they that fucking their, their graphics and what they did at the time were just so right. fucking racy and just so all over the place. Yeah, mm-hmm. it's kind of right up their alley. To do something it like was that. right up their alley. But yeah. there had they had no actual writers for it, right? No. Okay. So it was just a, it was just a Those ploy. Dudes, just whoever piss. would try to ride for that would get hated on yeah. real fucking quick. Uh, so, I think yeah, they were actually trying to that. get riders, right? I, I think, think the, so. so. But Sal Rocco, come on, yeah, you ain't gonna get nobody, yeah, huh? Unless you promise uh, them Sal that money. Rocco, yeah, he was he was in on you know the thieving of the Terminator wheels and all that. Mm-hmm. Oh, really? I, I would I I know yeah because he, he left was the, the door open. Manager. Left the door open. I would say Sal, I got you on lunch today. But you just fucking turn your back, player. Mm-hmm. Really? I would bring him. Yeah, bring this him is back like good fellas, cheese. like going for the Lufthansa heist. It was, dude. It really was. <laughs> I mean, lunch. yeah, yeah. We we would do whatever it took to shut his ass up. And he would turn a blind eye. Yeah. What a I time to be alive, man. Yeah, I mean, this is how crazy we were. And the door, I remember the door to the warehouse was locked, and I remember fucking Javante came running full speed and just ninja kicked the shit <laughs> and oh fucking God. first try. Door down, boom! It was like wow. Everyone ran in, like the pinata yeah. just got got wow. burst open. Exactly, exactly. Looting the wheel box. Like, oh That's God. so sick. I remember too, like trying, like you know, don't take everything. Because then we'll get caught. <laughs> okay. Take, take, I love the reasoning you know, right? of a kid. Yeah, oh my exactly. god! A little bit. So, yeah. 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 So we'll just take fifty. We'll leave five sets. We'll take fifty sets. Take leave five. And they, there was no like you know tracking system. It was all very manual. They'd grab wheels, put it in a bar. You know, shipment. So if there was probably what do you think, John? One hundred twenty wheels. E- we would easy. Take 100. Easy. Yeah. But here's my sure. question, right? Because 
you guys would take stuff from the warehouse, right? And then load it up and everything. They created this closet for just you guys. And they had the blank boards in there and everything. Because, so, because of that. Yeah. Yeah. Because but now the that, closet's though. locked and now you're well, breaking yeah. into the closet. Yeah, going over the top. Over the t- You would send Daniel through the roof. Yeah. Yeah. The smallest. <laughs> to open the no, door. literally. Yeah. Literally. You're just, uh, yeah. Okay. But my. <laughs> <wanted to> make- <laughs> <laughs> no. It, it's, I, yeah. It's true. But. um. <laughs> You would think that that would be just a fair game because that stuff's for you guys. You know what I'm saying? Like you're stealing well, like from what's supposed to be your for you guys. Look, I, I think there was like an uprise, and that's kind of how Girl started. Is I remember I was you know I befriended the accountant. It was this I forget his name Jeffrey or whatever. This this little Filipino dude in the accounting department. Okay. And in the accounting department was him and, you know, all of his records, but camera or the monitors because they had cameras. Mm. And I remember ejecting all the tapes, but I remember call or talking to him about reports and I was getting info. And I was reporting it back to the truth. I was getting intel, reporting it back to the troops. (laughs) And a lot of eyebrows were starting to get raised. (laughs) Okay. Well, info about what, though? Board sales, oh. royalty checks, numbers, mm. very similar to Death Row Records. It wasn't <laughs> adding up. It wasn't adding up. So, <laughs> so, so he's so, just willful, just giving you information. Kind of, sort of, but not willful. You were giving was, him lunch. I, I was strategically asking in a way where he would give info that I would get further info and it wouldn't add up and things started to be okay, questioned, whatever. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Gotcha, gotcha. But nonetheless, that's kind of why dudes were like, all right, well then we got to take it upon ourselves. Right. You know, it was almost like survival of the fittest Yeah. to be honest, because yeah. they were making their money as a business, but we were kind of a little being shortchanged, thin, a little thin on the diet. Yeah. So <laughs> I think everyone took it upon themselves. And then I think that's kind of how girls started. I was going to say, we could almost attribute you for uh, starting that spearhead. <laughs> fire, yeah. Spearhead that thing. Yeah. Hell yeah. Yeah. Go ahead and give me the credit. <laughs> <laughs>